So I suffered from childhood sexual trauma from the time I was five and uh, pretty much my whole childhood. And for me, it made me feel like I was crazy. It made me feel extremely depressed. I had severe anxiety. I just really felt like I couldn't function on a daily basis. And it was just really difficult to find hope in even being alive. And I uh, kept a secret from my family for 21 years. And back in 2017, I ended up telling my family about um, my childhood sexual abuse. And luckily I have a very supportive family and everything, you know, went better than planned. But unfortunately I was left with all the emotions that I had suppressed since I was five years old. And it caused me to go into a downward spiral of extreme depression. I attempted suicide once and I just basically had no hope to live any longer. And I basically hit a breaking point where I needed to find something or somewhere to heal because I always knew that I was put on this earth to do something bigger and better, but being lost in my depression, I just honestly felt like that wasn't possible. But I, uh, I found this place and what drew me to it was when I was looking online, I found a tab that said childhood sexual trauma and it, everywhere else that I looked, that wasn't mentioned, it just said PTSD, which I knew I had, but the fact that it was geared towards childhood sexual trauma, I knew that this was the place that I needed to go. And I just, I was just ready to start being grateful to live and, you know, just wanted to truly heal because I've definitely known that I was just made to do something bigger. I just needed to find myself. And for me and my trauma, that was kind of the biggest thing. I lost myself, I was, I identified you know, with my trauma. I didn't know who I was and, you know, keeping a secret since I was five years old, I felt like I built up these castle walls and it was to protect myself. And then when I told my family and everybody, it felt like that wall had come down and I didn't really know who was behind that wall. And I felt very vulnerable and just broken. And coming here, I realized that I'm not broken. It's just, you know, you need to learn to work through your trauma and that it is possible to heal, but it does take hard work. Um, but I can attest that in the end, the hard work is worth it. I feel different in many ways. Um, when I first got here, I was very numb. I was closed off. I really wasn't in touch with my emotions because I was very good at suppressing them. I had a lot of years of practice of doing so. Um, but for me now, I, I actually am grateful to be alive. I feel excited to wake up in the morning. I don't feel so cloudy in my head. My um, anxiety is almost non-existent anymore. I don't feel hopeless. I actually feel excited to see what the day holds for me. And, you know, for me, I was always stuck in these constant thought loops, just negative. I had this inner critic that just, it seemed like its whole job was to tear me down. And coming here, I learned that that's actually a protection that you build up. And now I just, I really see the beauty in everything. And I always had a connection to nature, but now going through this program, I, I, it just basically got me back in touch with that deep feeling that I had towards nature. And, you know, I always seek solace in nature because it was the true mother that was, you know, nurturing me and loving me. And I just have an actual connection with spirituality now, which I never had before. I didn't grow up religious and I knew I was always lacking something to believe in, um, whether it be myself or something external. But for me now, I actually have this very strong connection with spirituality and I feel like I can trust my gut instincts now. I always would second guess myself. I knew I had those gut instincts that would pop their head in, but I learned to ignore it because I felt I couldn't trust myself because in a sense I felt like I was crazy or there was something wrong with me, but I now I feel completely different because I know there's nothing wrong with me. I'm not my trauma. I don't identify with my trauma. It happened, but the beauty in it is there are so many gifts that I got to learn about myself and learn to love myself through, you know, going through the hard stuff, doing the shadow work and really digging deep. And I just, I feel clear, I feel excited. I feel more in tune. I used to suppress all my emotions and I never really realized that suppressing the negative also suppresses the positive. <laughs> and so for me now, 
I just feel like I have a full range of emotions. I can feel everything and I feel it so deeply. And I just, what I feel most different about is I actually found myself. I know who I am. I know what I want in life. I know how strong I am. I know that I can persevere and that I'm made to heal and help other people. And I'm just really excited to feel like I found my, my soul's true calling and that I can listen to myself and trust myself and that, you know, I'm doing much better and I'm, I feel very different. <laughs>